and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brooklyn. Um, and I am currently living in Florida doing the Disney College program and I just accepted a teaching position for this year. So bringing y'all along with that, I am teaching at a private Christian school this year. So that'll be slightly different than the usual. Um, and I'm teaching a fourth and fifth grade split class. So that'll also be different. And I only have 10 kids. So, or maybe 11, possibly 11, he said. But um, yeah, so it's a really small school. I'm gonna have a really small class. I think it's gonna be a great year. I'm actually really excited. I did stop at Starbucks. I got a chai and then a ham and Swiss croissant, as well as I have some other things that I need to take in. Um, and I have asked and I am allowed to film in my class. So um, I am gonna go in and film a little bit, I think, but we're gonna be kind of like sparing with what we film just because my room actually happens to be just like parallel with the office. So I kind of feel awkward because <laughs> um, there's a lot of people in the office right now getting ready. So I'm going to bring all my stuff in. Um, we have a lot we need to do today. I need to finish up my schedule. Um, I need to do the curriculum. I have a mirror that I need to put up. I need to put my wow wall. I think that's it. Everything else I did up like previously, like the last few days, because this is the third, no, fourth day of in-service that we've had. Um, and I just haven't filmed anything yet. So sorry, y'all are getting like the tail end of classroom setup, but that's still okay. It's still something, right? So let's go in. Also today is, um, staff picture day. We're getting our pictures for our lanyards. So that's why I am like kind of more put together than usual. So I usually don't wear this kind of outfit for like classroom setup, but let's get inside. Slight change of plans. We're actually doing meet the teacher right now. So I'll talk to y'all a little later. Okay guys, so I'm in my room. I'm gonna talk really low because there are people around. I don't want to disturb them, but this is my classroom. Um, this is it. Um, I just met a few of my students. They're all super sweet. We're doing like a, um, kind of like an easy parent, like meet the teacher where um, they don't really have like a set time. They have like a few hours every day that they can come in to meet us. Um, so that's still going on and if, if one of my kids come in comes in they'll let me know and i'll go over to the other building that we're meeting them in but i need to go ahead i have a few things that i need to get done i need to finish up my schedule i forgot to print this one off so i'll have to do that whenever i get home but i have these two that i can put up um and then i have some things i need to laminate i have some things i need to cut out that kind of thing the classroom is pretty much done <laughs> um it's just like the nitty gritty getting random things done and I need to plan and like get seats together. So let's work on that. Okay, so I got everything cut out. Now I need to go to my car because I forgot the mirror in there because I'm doing an affirmation station. I wasn't going to, but I did get a mirror from Walmart. So I need to go grab that from my car so I can hang it up and put the affirmations on it. Um, then we're gonna put these up on the board on our schedule. And then I have my wow work wall that I'm gonna put up right behind my desk. Um, I need to put the banner up. So I'm gonna go to my crap. My little bit. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go to my car and grab the mirror. So here's the mirror. Hello. Um, so now I need to get it hung up somehow and then put the affirmations on it. I think I want it on this little wall. I think it's just a little cute right here. I'll zoom out. So like it'll be like right as you enter right here. It'll kind of be right there. And I can take cute pictures in it every day. So super excited about that. Okay, so here she is, all with everything on it. Um, it says, I am loved, I am heard, I am safe, I am brave, I am smart, I am kind, I am valued, I am strong, and then I accidentally did heard 
twice, but I mean, I think it's good. It's saying it twice, so they make sure it's heard, that they are heard, and I don't feel like redoing it, so yeah, that's my affirmation station. Not a lot, but just a little something so that they know that they're loved. Next up, I'm gonna put these two labels on my schedule. I forgot to print off seat work, so I'll have to do that later, but let's go ahead and put these two up. So there's that, and then once I know the times, I'm just gonna write the times beside it. Okay, I've talked to some coworkers, and I think I'm actually gonna leave the mirror on the floor for now. Um, if I need to put it up later, we may, but I'm just scared of it falling. <laughs> um, but now I'm gonna work on my wow work wall. So that's gonna go right here in this little bit behind my desk. It's a really small room, because I don't have that many kids, but I think that'll be the perfect place for it. So now I wanted to get all these desks cleared off, so I'm putting all of the curriculum inside the desk so that it's out of the way and set up for when the kids come in, they can just get it out of their desks and put their names on it. Here they are all set up, just how I wanted it. Now it's time to work on some curriculum. Okay y'all, it is like so much later, like it's almost 4.30 right now. Did not intend to stay this long, we were allowed to leave at 12.30, but I decided to go ahead and start planning um, because I've never used this curriculum. I just want to get on top of it so I have been planning and I'm just planning for two different grades as well so it's taking a little bit of time but I have um so far math for both grades reading for both grades and spelling for both grades for the whole first week completed so I say that is good what I'm doing is this I'll show you so I have this little like can you really see it um like little slide opened on my canva and I can copy if I can get it to copy I can copy this little thing and then I can and it's going to bring me to my math lessons for this entire week which we're only doing four days worth of lessons next week but I have all my lessons fourth and fifth written out right beside each other so I'm gonna do this for all of the classes for every day and then I'm going to highlight um what I'm doing first and what I'm doing second. So like for this one, I might have my fourth grade. What we're gonna do are flashcards together. So I'm gonna highlight all that in like pink because we're doing it together. And then I might have fifth grade work on their textbook. So I'll highlight that in blue because that's what they're gonna do first. And I'll talk and do my lesson with fourth grade, highlight that in blue. Then second will be orange. So orange will be their um, workbook. And then orange for fifth grade will be like me talking to them. So. It doesn't really make sense when I'm talking about it like that, but I'm really excited to do it this way. That way I have it all together. But because I'm doing it so like detailed, it is taking me a little while. Reading took forever. Um, reading was really confusing, the curriculum. So I'm gonna try to like really like dig into that curriculum to get it a little, to understand it a little better. But yeah, that's what I've been doing recently. Um, I also have a bunch of things that I need to copy. I'm like making notes of what I need to copy. That way, hopefully by tomorrow afternoon, I can just give my um, our assistant, like our administrative assistant, all of the things I need copied for the week. And we'll have to deal with that. Um, but yeah, let me show you what I've done so far in the room. Like I'll give you a little mini room tour since I've been kind of MIA. So when you walk into my door, only this door is gonna be opened. Um, this one's gonna stay shut. I had a birthday thing there, but it's rolling up, so I don't know. But I have my first thing of desks, and I went ahead and put all their books in there, as well their, as their agendas, how I wanted them. Um, over here we have our calendar, seasons, weather, then today is da da da. This is gonna be my Bible bulletin board, and I have a bulletin board for every single subject. 
That way, um, I'm going to put anchor chart paper on them and do anchor charts so that we can keep up with our objectives, goals, and what we're learning. Um, but yeah, there's that. And the border and the paper are both from Hobby Lobby as well as this is also from Hobby Lobby. I made my um, little banner like headers this year really quickly in Canva. Um, then over here we have my board. That's like, I'm using my checklist. My board is not magnetized, I found out, so just falls straight off, so that's just chilling there. Um, but on here I have my schedule. I need to make the seat work one. Also just made this in Canva really fast. I have a welcome banner. You can't really see it on camera, but you can see it in person. I have my string lights going and then a clock. Over here in this little nook is where I have my like, I don't know what you call this thing, but it has all my curriculum, turn in bins, sharpener tape, that kind of stuff. I already showed you my little mirror, we're leaving that. Here's my reading and language board. So it's gonna be cut in half to um, different anchor charts um, for those two subjects. Desk, <laughs> um, my desk over here, I have this little cart with all my stuff on it. And I'm just kind of zooming over cause I'm gonna do more in depth later. Um, file organizer, pencil, um, my cup, my computer, sign, Ms. Meyers banner, calendar, um, chair, <laughs> the more string lights, wow work wall. And I know it's not centered, but I honestly don't care enough to redo it. Um, and I have 12 papers up there. Um, and I'm only going to have, right now, I think I only have 11 kids on my roster, so it should be fine. Over here, we have our math and then health. It's going to be split down the middle again. I have my skip counting numbers up top. Also, I had to make all of these boards and just put them on the wall. There are no actual bulletin boards in here. So that's why some of them look a little funky, but we're, we're fine. Also got these on TPT. I'll leave the link down below. I made my headers again. Here we have history and science. They're gonna be small um, charts and yeah. So, and then I have my other set of desks. This desk is gonna go out and that trash can, I don't know where it's gonna go. But yeah, this is my classroom. So obviously it's pretty tiny, but it's kind of what I wanted. Um, and I feel like I've made it homey. So it doesn't really matter to me that it's a little tiny, but yeah, this is my classroom. It's a Wednesday night. So I do need to get going home, check in on the cat, um, and then get ready for church this evening. So I think, I think I'm done for the day. Yeah, I think I'm done for the day. I'll talk to y'all maybe this evening. Maybe I'll go ahead and close out so I can post this today. Who knows? We'll figure out in a little bit. Alrighty y'all, I'm home now. The cat's great. Um, I ate my dinner. It's almost time to go to church now. Um, but I think I am gonna go ahead and post this video today, even though it's not gonna be very long. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and post it. That way y'all have something to look forward to. So I'll give it to you a little bit now and then I'm gonna film again tomorrow in the next few days. So you'll get a little more content then as well. But I hope you enjoyed. Um, I did want to go ahead and say I did have someone, um, a few people actually, comment on my last video and like my um, short and everything, asking if I have a like a Amazon wish list, and I wasn't going to do one, um, just because it's like not my first year teaching. I did one last year, um, and if you gave last year, thank you so much. All that stuff is still with that class. I did not like take it with me when I left. Um, only one or two things I actually took with me. Um, like a book set of books that I'm actually using at this new classroom as well. Um, but um, yeah, everything from last time is still with that class. Um, but if you wanted, I did make one uh, wish list for this year just to have it. Um, my school is pretty small. So like we don't like have a ton of funding and we're like private also. So like there ain't no state funding or nothing. Um, but yeah, if you want to, don't feel pressured. Um, I have what I need to get through the year, but if you did want to look at my um, wish list, it is linked down below. Um, and my Teachers Pay Teachers and my LTK shop are also down there if you want to look for any of the things that I mentioned in this video or I'm wearing, that kind of thing. But um, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and head on out to church. So I'm going to go ahead and end this video. If you're not already, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel to stay updated on all the content that will be coming soon. And I will catch y'all in the next classroom setup video. Mm -hmm.